So how are you guys this morning? Good? I have to admit, I'm kind of sad this morning. Because there were a bunch of things that happened this week that weren't very good. They were kind of sad this week. There were some people in France, and some in Baghdad, and some in Beirut that were hurt. And there were some children in Africa that were hurt. And there was even an earth earthquake in in Mexico and Japan this week. It was really kind of a sad week for us this week. But, you know, I brought a couple of things with me. Let's see here. This one. This is my dog captain. And, you know, when I get kind of sad, sometimes I really just want to squeeze and hug something. And he looks like my dog, but my real dog won't let me do this to him. So I get to do this with, with captain. And he kind of he makes me feel a little bit better. But something else I brought with me that really, really helps, this, this is my Bible. This one was given to me when I was in third grade. So it's a little over 30 years old now. And I've had this with me a long time. And it, it has stories in it of people who, who were in trouble, people who were hurt, people who were really, really good, and maybe some people who weren't so good. And I have different things marked that remind me of different people and different situations. And, you know, all these stories in here, the one thing that, that's true for every story in this book is that God was with all of the people in this book. And it reminds us that God is with us no matter what happens. Remember when we pray in Sunday school that to thank God for all the good things that happen and help to remind us that God is still with us when things aren't so good. And that's what this helps me do. And this gives me a lot of comfort. So even though things maybe weren't so good this week, I wanted to share some of that comfort with you so that if maybe you're sad, you can remember that no matter what, God is always with us. So let's have a quick prayer before we go, you go with Miss Brenda to Sunday school. And let's pray for the people that, that had a hard time this week, okay? Dear God, thank you for always being with us. And please be with the people in Kenya and France and Baghdad and Beirut and even those in Mexico and Japan who are all having such a hard time right now. Amen. Amen. <laughs>